but tell me what you think which of the martin quarter horse fillies that we own is your favorite Hey farm friends, we have some beautiful horses and three of those beautiful horses come from a place called Martin's Quarter Horses in Bayfield, Colorado. Oops, I was trying to keep her out of your sight. So I'm gonna spend some time with the two fillies we have from Martin's Quarter Horses and uh, you tell me which one's your favorite. So. Well guys, this is the filly we call Blue Mickey. And she is about June, July, August. She's about 16 months old right now. And she's a blue roan. And she is beautiful. And she is one that I would really like to breed to 66 or one of his sons. He has two sons that are still intact that are owned by my brother Levi and they are both sons of 66 and sons of Chipper, our mare. And so they're Nuggets brothers. <laughs> so anyway, I would love to maybe breed one of them to this girl because they're, they're both roans and they're related to Chipper, which Chipper is our favorite horse. And then we got Blue Mickey that's a roan and so it'd be fun to get another homozygous roan offspring, which could happen if we bred her to 66 also, but I just think it'd be fun to tie Chipper's line in with 66's line and with the Martin's quarter horse line. So anyway, I'm just kind of talking to you as I let her graze here in the pumpkin patch. The pumpkin patch is starting to give way to fall. You can see a pumpkin right there, but the pumpkin plants themselves are starting to freeze. I don't know if you can see, see that black above the pumpkin. The leaves of the pumpkins are actually pretty delicate and so they freeze before everything. We haven't had a frost actually, but it was cold enough for them to start dying. So I'm just out here letting Blue Mickey graze among the weeds and the grass and the pumpkins. But anyway, so this is Blue Mickey. And again, she comes from Martin's Quarter Horses in Bayfield, Colorado. And Mickey's mom is actually being exposed right as we speak to 66. So you could get, you have a possibility of getting her little brother or sister if you want to contact Martin's Quarter Horses and say, hey, put me on the list. And if it's this color or this gender, then I want to put down a deposit or whatever. Peyton, what you doing, buddy? This, what I didn't hear you said something about 66. Yeah. Is this the farm under 66? You like being on the farm under 66 with Papa, don't you? What are you doing with the horsey and, and, and the pancakes? Oh, I'm letting him just eat some grass. He was drinking out of the hose. It looks like he wet his pants, but he's drinking out of the hose and 
Yep, we still do that here on the farm on Route 66. It's amazing I'm still alive. Ow. I'm just letting Blue Mickey graze for a minute. I just let her go. She can't go far. She won't want to go far. She'll step on a rope and I'll grab her butt. Anyway, so guys, tell me what you think of Blue Mickey. So I will include a copy of Mickey's papers. She's walking away. I thought she'd stand more still while we talked about her. Oops. I think Fred the Peacock has learned that pumpkins taste good because something is pecking at these pumpkins, some of them. It's been so much fun. We've had just some young families. Some of my old students bring their kids and pick pumpkins lately and it's just been fun to see a smile on their face. Maybe I'll show you some of those. Oh, how cute. Is that one you want? Okay, we'll ask for the shovel. Let's go get it. I don't know if we'll do pumpkins again. It's been fun, but like there's a pumpkin, right? there's pumpkins everywhere in here. But we didn't know if we had an enough to invite the elementary school to come on a field trip here. But we definitely have enough to invite families to come grab pumpkins and enjoy some time on the farm. And that's what we've done lately. It's made, made some kids happy and it's been fun to have them around here. But I will include, if Vicky hasn't already put it in the editing, I will include a copy of Blue Mickey's papers and you can tell me what you think. Ooh, dang it. Look at the squash bugs that are getting on these pumpkins. It's definitely time to wrap it up for the season. But, we have pumpkins everywhere. It's really fun. But the reason I like Blue Mickey so much is her temperament. She is just so, so quiet. She just lets me pet all over, love on her, do her feet, load her in a trailer. I mean, she just does everything. She's just awesome. And I'm sure Jet, or not Jet, sorry, Peppy, what did I say, Jet? Peppy will get there too. I haven't had Peppy here long, but she's the next one that I'll show you. And uh, tell me which one's your favorite Martin's Quarter Horse Philly. Now remember, Gold 66 is also a Martin's Quarter Horse. So you can tell I like Martin's Quarter Horses. And I'm super excited for the collaboration we have going between Martin's Quarter Horses and the farm on Route 66. So, well, Blue Mickey, I hope you're enjoying just eating some green grass and weeds out here among the, the pumpkins. See, there's, there's squash bugs everywhere. It's crazy. It's definitely time to call it quits for the year, I think. We just, the weeds and bugs got ahead of us, but but we definitely got some pumpkins, it was fun. So hopefully we can make some more families happy as we invite them over to the farm on Route 66. Well, I put Mickey away and now I have Peppy. And I'm gonna kind of do the same thing. It's been an hour or two though and the sun's lower in the horizon and so the shadows may be better or worse. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But anyway, so tell us which horse is your favorite out of Mickey and Peppy. So here's Peppy, guys. And that cut on her shoulder is healing up quickly and very well. 
see uh, ran into a gate or fence or something in Florida and that's what happened but it'll heal up it definitely doesn't affect her at all as far as being sound it's just maybe affecting her cosmetically but she's so good looking it doesn't even affect her much that way so I let Lex out there's not even fences all the way around this field right now but they're so excited to get out and graze that they're staying staying put but anyway I'm gonna take her down a little closer to Lex maybe and Vicky just rode by with the grandkids but tell me what you think of Peppy and this Peppy as I've told you in the past is a three-quarter sister to gold 66 their moms are full sisters no I'm sorry gold 66 and Peppy their dads are uh, are the same so they have the same dad and their moms are half sisters so that's what makes them three quarter sisters or brother and sister i'm really messing this up but anyway isn't she pretty though she is gorgeous you're a pretty girl and i will include a picture of her pedigree also she's about two or three inches taller than Mickey at this time but their moms are about the same height but you know maybe Peppy's dad is a little taller I don't know it'll be interesting but tell me what you think which of the Martin quarter horse fillies that we own is your favorite is it blue Mickey or peppy and uh, I think they're both pretty gorgeous here comes Lex to check out who's in the field hey Lex how are you girl yeah I'm letting a couple of you enjoy this green grass and uh, Lex is our tallest horse. I think it was on this video that I told you she's about 15'1. So not a super tall horse. But Peppy at 16 or 17 months old is not much shorter than Lex. So it's going to be so fun to see how she turns out. keeps turning so you guys see that cut on her shoulder but like I say it's already closed up a ton just in the week and a half or so that we've owned her and uh, it's getting better all the time my mom's pine gum salve is doing its magic if you want some of that you give my mom a call and uh, see how you can get some of Adeline's aid she calls it my mom also has her own channel that we've talked her into doing and uh, that's Sweet Grandma Adeline. So I'll put the link to that and her phone number so you could give her a call if you're interested. All right, Lex, don't be getting all crazy while I'm holding on to smear. I wish you would just stop and eat, but that's okay. I don't think you guys are minding this pretty view. I wish she was turned the other way so you didn't have to see that sore on her but I'm just out here the intent wasn't to come lunge a horse it was just to let her out in this green beautiful pumpkin patch and enjoy moving around as you can see Peppy has some more pep than Mickey does so there you go guys which is your favorite Mickey or Peppy Peppy, 
What's who would you vote on yourself or or Mickey? Are you arrogant or humble? <laughs> but anyway, beautiful night. The sun will be setting here in a little bit. And maybe I'll just show you, let you enjoy watching the horses while the sun sets. <laughs>